hi viewers you're welcome to another episode of start pro in this episode i'll be showing you how you can design a strip footing in start pro so um to do that the first thing you need to do is you have to model your building and then you have to analyze it so this particular building has been analyzed if you don't know how it got analyzed you can watch my previous videos on the analysis of buildings okay so um now what we just need to do is you can go to foundation design and then i'll be using all of the supports i will also be using all of the loads so you click on include all of the load then you can run the start foundation okay all right so um these are the column points these are the supports so um what i will just do is i'll go to the load factors and then i'll just generate my load combination i will change this to british and then um, you can see this is load combination 101 so i will generate that okay and then for the ultimate limit state that is load combination number 201 so generate that and then click on okay then you can close that so after doing that um you can go to job setup and then you create a new job all right so under the name let me give it strip one all right give it strip one and then order the um the job type you see that actually there is no um strip foundation but you just need to click on combined um after combined footing the design code i'll be using um british so click on british and then i'll be using si all right so for this one um for the first strip um click on this um column also this one and then this one so i want to have a strip in this direction so um take all of the node and then you can just click on create job all right so the job will be created and then you now come here you can see strip footing so click on create from selected node that is all of the three nodes that i've selected there will be a um a strip footing for it you can see so just click on this and then you have that so um you can create more let's just create more at once so pick this pick this and then you pick this then you create one more pick this pick this pick this and then you create another one you can see you have footing c1 footing c2 footing c3 okay so create this create this create this and then you can have that so you can see the footing then this one and then this one so create that as well then you have this one this one and then this one so you can create that as well so those are the um the strip footing for that so when you are done doing that you can come to the um combined footing job then you can go to the design parameters you can change your you know every um thing you need to change here maybe your unit weight you know your strength and everything so i prefer to leave everything as default for now then you can go to cover anything you want to change here you can change it and then the geometry still the same thing so then you can go to the design then you click on yes all right so if you see you so when you look at that you see strip footing design so this is the strip footing design and then this is the code it's used to design the strip footing so the first one the second one the third one the fourth one the fifth one and the sixth one i believe you know what that so this one in this direction that's the first this one is second this one is the third this is the fourth this is the fifth and this is the sixth so um you can check your so this is the calculation sheet so if you want to check for this first one you can just click on this one if you want to check the calculation sheet for the strip 41 so you can see this is all you have under that right so you can check as much as you like so whatever i want to see there you can go through it then you can also check your detail drawing so um this is how the you know the elevation look like so you can see this is the first column point and then the second column point the third column point you can see how the reinforcement looks like okay so um that is how you do that so if you want to check you can see this is the detail for footing c1 that is the first one so if you want to check for another one just you know you can check for it 
want to check for the third one you know, check for it and if you want to save it as a note you know but you can save it as a drawing and then you will save it in whatever format you want to save it all right so this is how you design a strip foundation in start pro v8 i thanks for watching if you like the video make sure you give it a like and if you haven't subscribed make sure you subscribe before you leave thanks for watching